Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Benny Dorm Scooter Sue here. Just a little video, we decided to finally try the bubble tea. Now, let's see what we think of it. Marcus, what one did you have? I've had a chocolate Oreo one. And what do you think? It's it's weird. It's weird. Why is it weird? It it's got bubbles in, guys. It has literal chocolate bubble. It's got chocolate bubbles in it. Can you drink a bubble and? Probably won't get one there. <laughs> yeah, he's got a bubble on his tongue, guys. Yeah. No. I mean... It's... <laughs> a bit of an argument going on. Now I've had a caramel um, frappy like sort of thing, iced coffee, frappy with bubbles, you can see my bubbles a bit more clearer. I mean, oh you can see them in yours, yeah. The bubbles are what's putting me off it guys, like they ain't really shot. Tasting. And the bubbles are weird because they kind of pop in your mouth. Um, I've just tried putting my tongue against the straw, but it doesn't really stop them. Oh, yeah, you can't really drink it without getting bubbles in it. But it's. You can. Try and put your tongue into the straw. So I don't think Marcus is a fan. You can swallow them, mm. like try not to bite them down. You mm. don't get the bubble taste. And they do do teas, they do like fruit ones, they do fizzy ones. And milkshakes. My question would be, there is, can you get them without the bubbles? For one, and maybe. See, I seem to be drinking it now and not getting as but many as the bubbles. How do you get the chocolate bubble though? I really don't know. Um, it is more like maybe for the teas, refreshing for the tea, but yeah. Maybe. Maybe not try them again. Not the best thing I can try, but I mean. <laughs> Look at his poor face. You know what, guys? It's not one of his crazy Marcus cocktails. It, it's just weird tasting on me. At least we can say we've tried them, I suppose. Uh -huh. But, yeah. So, yeah, Marcus sent... They are really weird, the bubbles. Without the bubbles, the milkshake itself would be nice, but it's just the bubbles that make it weird. But like you're not 
used to drinking so much and nothing not for real beers. So can I think I'm up for it? You finish yours. <laughs> He's trying to dump his on mine. I do not like it one bit. I'm sorry guys. It's just weird. The bubbles do not taste anything like chocolate. Mm. I mean, I say I've got other flavoured bubbles, so mm. I don't know. like the flavour. I don't, I don't really know. know. Okay guys, so that's a bubble tea shop just there, just for fun time, kind of crazy shop. Let me know if you're ever going to try it or you've tried it already. So Marcus, your experience of bubble tea, you had a bubble Oreo milkshake, would you have one again? No, I wouldn't have it again, I mean. I'll bite it a 5 out of 10 on me. The milkshake's nice, but with the bubbles, that just makes it weird, to be honest. Like, and I mean, it's still confusing. I mean, how are they getting flavoured bubbles? Like, weird. But, yeah. <laughs> yeah, guys. Um, I'll maybe give them a 7 or an 8. Um, they are nice, don't get me wrong, it was nice, but yeah, the bubbles Weird. do take a bit of getting used to. So, let me know in the comments below whether you've tried one of these bubble teas, or a bubble coffee, bubble <laughs> milkshake. They are kind of like actual bubbles, aren't they? Uh -huh. They aren't actual bubbles. So I think it's just so weird. <laughs> no, I thought I had chocolate bubbles in mine, I don't think I did. You probably had like tapioca or strawberry or something. There are more chocolate. I love Benny Dawn and why not guys it's what life's about so hit the like hit the share hit subscribe smash that notification bell to make sure that you always get notified of when I upload more great content guys let me know what you think of the new haircut do you like it yes or no um, also as I said let me know if you have tried one of the bubble teas what did you think i'll see you on the next video guys